Hi, it's Paul Liano here from Tangmere Dental Care. We're going to be undertaking a few tests today. We're actually going to be measuring a real aerosol during a real AGP um, using the scalers and uh, then the GBT machine. Um, I've got my, my mum in here who um, is going to be holding the particulate meter and the camera so we can actually measure what the levels reach and then I'll hopefully reach over and press the timer to see how quickly they settle. Susie, uh, my dental therapist and my wife, obviously all in my social bubble so we're all fairly safe even though we're actually going to be wearing PPE. So first we're going to be getting on with the readings in relation to the scalers and then we'll move on. So we'll, uh, we'll do that in sections, hopefully, in this one video. Right, okay, so I've got my PPE on. I'm just going to um, put the dental air into position, uh, which I think it is already, so that's at a working height. And, uh, and then we'll just crank that up to full power. So I'll just bend down and we'll use the little remote control. in place and um, the Winix uh, air filtration, the dental air is set to 100%. The only thing that we haven't got is the open window because what we want to do is to prove is to prove that uh, maybe we don't actually need to freeze and that this will do on its own in relation to reducing fallow times. So um, yeah, absolutely no readings that I could see at any stage. Now we're uh, changing over to the um, to the piece on, uh, and Susie's going to be scaling the uh, the lower teeth here.
going to do is pick up the camera and see if I can show you the spray going up the, uh, the tube here. Okay, well that's done, that's actually a full scaling upper and lower using obviously a Capitron and uh, then the Pizon. And, uh, and yeah, I mean, you know, obviously the particulate meter did time out there, but I will watch that back later. And it really hasn't gone, uh, you know, obviously end of AGP, and the air quality is absolutely excellent because of course the dental air down here, um, down there is, is sucking away 100%. Uh, and then of course we've got the Vinix uh, machine over in the corner there um, that, is, uh, that is also showing excellent, excellent air quality, that's what the blue light indicator on that means. Okay then we'll just take a minute and we'll be changing over to do the thing that I'm sure a lot of people are actually really, really sort of looking forward to, which is the, uh, the GBT machine. We've actually got the EMS unit over here, and so that's there. That has uh, the, uh, the classic soft comfort powder on one side, which we won't be using. That's actually a slightly uh, coarser particulate than the erythritol powder on the other side. Uh, and I would have to say that that machine, that machine is something that uh, we uh, we really want to bring back into use. Right, okay, so let's uh, crank up the dental air to full power. Give the uh, hand a little run and drop. Check the particular meter. Thank you. 
also going to pick up the camera and see if I can show you a little bit close up. I'm going to be using the, uh, the Perio Flow part of it now into a pocket. So uh, that's, uh, that's there. or a dentist and you see this video and you think that this is valid and we can actually now start uh, possibly cleaning teeth with the most challenging piece of equipment which is the GBT machine which is the thing that really maxed out the meter and just didn't come down on that baseline test you know, within almost an hour so if you think that this is valid we need to have some votes so to speak so please comment below if you want to see other tests like this because I'm going to do a few others uh, in relation to using the turbine and maybe a, a, a small study, if you like, of actual treatments and AGPs. And then, uh, and then we'll see whether, uh, hopefully, we can get uh, the powers of the B to uh, actually say we don't need fallow time, we just need our PPE on and we can start the deep clean straight away as soon as we finish and then obviously uh, that will make it sort of a bit more of a viable business and obviously more affordable for patients as well. So thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, until the next one.